All right, guys, today we're going to be talking about this holster. This is a holster from Carolina Concealment Solutions. My buddy down there, Jody Collins in South Carolina, put this together for me for the P09 Tactical with the Surefire X300 Ultra Light. It's a pretty cool little package. He also put together a double mag pouch for me. It's pretty cool. Let's go ahead. We'll go back to the uh, Hacienda there, put it underneath the lights, and do a tabletop review. I ran this thing all weekend long over at Farmageddon and love it, I love it, I love it. Especially I love the double mag pouch because it is universal, fits a lot of different mags. But it's pretty cool, but meanwhile, we're out here doing some more shooting. So why don't we do some? Here we go. Really? All right, guys, we're back on the review table. And just to recap, this is the CZ P09 Tactical, which comes with the ray suppressor sights here and here and a threaded barrel. This makes it a very difficult customer to find a holster for right out of the bat. One of the cool things that I do love about this gun is it is a complete combat package. It has 22 rounds with one in the pipe, making it a bad mamma jamma. Now, Another thing that makes it a difficult package is I wanted to add the Surefire Light. This is the X300 Ultra that I won in the giveaway from Mr. Nolan's Mindset. And I'm going to put his link down below. If you would, please visit his YouTube channel and give him a shout out. Just tell him I sent you. Well, anyway, you got this as a total package. You've got the Ray Suppressor Sight, which makes it almost impossible to find a holster that will accommodate this as a, as a package. Now, my good friend down at Carolina Concealment Solutions, Mr. Jody Collins, he and I gave him a call. And I said, hey, Jody, I got a really neat deal. It's going to require some custom building, and I'm going to have to bring the gun down to you. So what I did was I took this firearm down with to him along with two of the magazines. And because, I, of course, with the holster, I wanted to go ahead and put together a double mag pouch so I can put it on the opposite side. Now, these belt loops right here are designed to fit on a combat belt, 2-inch or an inch and 7 eighths down to an inch and a half. I wear this all day long with an inch and a half, 511 uh, double-sided belt and have had zero issues. All right, so real quickly what we're going to do is I'm going to show you the fit and finish because the purpose of this video, one is I want to give a shout out to my boy down there, Jody Collins with Carolina Consumer Solutions. If I can say it a couple more times, I surely will because he did a fantastic job on this thing. I delivered the gun to him and I said, Jody, here's what I want. I want something that I can carry with a pancake holster. I do want it adjustable. I want to be able to carry it with a inch and a half to a two inch belt and go from there. Now, ultimately, this is going to go on a battle belt, which I thought was really cool. Now, he did make it where it is adjustable and again, a lot of times when you have a custom gun like this, you're going to have to have a custom holster built for it, and which may require you to visit the shop, wait, or leave it off with somebody you do trust, and that's a guy I do trust. So check this out. The fit and finish on this thing is second to none. Perfect. Look at that. Zero shakes, zero rattles. He did put the adjustment on there for me. This does have the .80 Kydex and did a great job of just blending the seams all the way around. You know, a very unique thing that he did on this one was go ahead and he captured both the barrel nut and the, not the barrel nut, but <laughs> the uh, thread protector. How many times you guys out there with your suppressor barrels, threaded barrels, do you reach down there on a day-to-day -day basis? And I did carry this with a leather holster and every now and then you just reach down there and make sure that your thread protector is tight. And I know a couple people are walking around without the thread protectors. This is the reason why I do like that right there. Put that in there just like that. It comes with this guy right here, which is set up with the same belt protect belt uh, loop deals and uh, the tensioning screw. Now, the nice thing about this is I use this. I use my SIG mags with this. I use a couple other mags, the uh, magazines for the TP9SF. And what else did I bring down there? I brought a bunch of stuff down to Farmageddon, and I ran this thing a couple different times. And every now and then, I would just have to take it off, wear something else, but I came back to it. But guys, I'm going to tell you something. Custom fit, custom finish, the edges, the fit and finish is absolutely incredible. It made room for the, the suppressor sights, as you can see right there, and it just worked out quite nicely. When you have a gun like this and you need a custom fit, go see your Kydex holster maker person it is, whatever. But anyway, if you're in the area and you need a custom holster made, South Carolina, look up the information down below, Carolina Concealment Solutions. I know uh, there's a couple other people that have purchased holsters from him, and he's been very, very successful. Other than that, guys, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate and leave them down in the comments section down below. I'm sure that Jody will make some comments down if anybody needs to reach him 
in person. I'm sure he will answer your uh, questions. Anyway, support the red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless those men and women in uniform 24-7 for our freedom because freedom is not free. Code of Boy 32 out. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I'll see if I can prop this up. Duh. That's awesome. Code of Boy 32 out.